Good morning, we're here at Sydney Airport because we're flying to Uluru. So we'll see the Ayers Rock the and our flight is at 10.30 so we're having breakfast, well brunch right now. The flight will be around 3 hours and I will see you when we get there. Outback Hotel and Lodge. There are a lot of accommodations here. There are apartment complexes, hotels, camping grounds, and lodges, and they're all under Ayers Rock Resort. The color palette is really beautiful with the blue sky, the green plants, and the red sand. We were actually told by the resort to wear dark clothing because if you use light colors, it might get stained by the red sand. We also brought lots of layers because since we're in the desert, the temperatures could get pretty intense like at night it could drop to two degrees and in the morning it could get hot it's so funny because while we were on the plane air structure suddenly popped out of nowhere in the middle of this vast desert we got a good view from the plane so if you're flying to Uluru it's nice to stay on the left side of the plane there's so much insects right now the resort actually issued not really warning but uh, I guess a list of all the animals you could encounter during your stay. So there are rodents, snakes, and different kinds of insects. There are also a lot of free activities. Later, I think around 4 o'clock, we'll take this guided walking tour. To the moon and back, we had a love like that. Why do I feel like that slowly fading? We used to be friends, that was way back when. You and I, we were a slow burn, babe Oh, we were young, so tonight Looked at the world through rose-colored glasses You had your goals, then you met me Did you let those dreams pass you by? 
barbecue night and we're eating here at the Outback Barbecue where you order the meats raw and then you're the one who will cook it and then they also have salad, a salad bar and they also serve potatoes, corn, bread morning it is 5 30 in the morning right now and the reason why we woke up early is we have a tour we are joining the katachuta tour with sunrise and breakfast katachuta is the other rock formation near ayers rock they're both part of the uluru katachuta national park it's three degrees right now so i'm wrapped up i have three layers on top so um, thermal, a thick thermal fleece, and a bubble jacket. It will be cold. So we're going to watch as the colors of the rock domes change along with the sky. from the lookout of Katachuta and we watched the sunrise it was so nice the we saw how Katachuta changed colors it went from like purplish to a bit orangey and now we are at this picnic ground and we'll have breakfast it comes with a tour and I'm pretty hungry there's a really beautiful view of Katachuta <laughs>
isotone. Beautiful flower, but uh, very, very poisonous. It's currently 2.20 and we just took a nap, got some rest because we started the day early for the tour this morning which was really nice by the way. We learned so much about the culture of the people here, the history of Katachuta and its geology. We got some rest because we needed energy since we will be going on another tour. This time we're going to watch the sunset in Uluru.
hour right now we're at this lookout there's Uluru and it looks small from this perspective but when we were right beside the rock it was gigantic we drove all the way around and we visited some of the sacred sites for the Ananu people it was really amazing learning about their cultures their traditions what they believe in and how they live and so different seeing the rock in person pictures and videos don't do justice it was beautiful and huge in person we saw while driving the iconic orangey color as the sun is setting. The sun's still out right now. That's why we're here waiting for it to set. It's 3 degrees right now. It's around 5.45. We're up early again. It's our last day of the year and we wanted to make the most out of the trip so we're going on another tour. This time it's the field of lights which is basically a field with lights obviously and it's overlooking Uluru. So there's the lights and there's the sunrise and there's the rock. So. I'm excited. It's new. It's one of the newer activities because when my dad was here, but that was like 20 years ago, it wasn't there yet. So, yeah, I'm still sleepy though. It's cold now, so I'm wearing gloves. I'm prepared because yesterday my hands were freezing. Mm.